Hey guys, Jim Lux here back with our blind playthrough of Arafel. So last time we left off, we got captured. It's pretty much a requirement of JRPGs. And then, uh, and, uh, now we're escaping from prison and we're going to save Seri Kesu before she is tortured. Oh, that's, see, yeah, that's no good. There's a dead guard right there. What's up, guys? Vampire, who are you? Some kind of vampire slayer or something. You're kind of small to be slaying vampires, aren't you? Evidently not. Wait, wait, wait. I recognize you. You're that kid from the surface we had locked up, huh? Correct. Well, we can't exactly let you walk out of here, you know. You're going back to that cell. Yeah, I understand. Nothing personal. Vampire. Well... Interesting. The one with lower health has a. Well, I don't know. Well, let's blast him. Alright, that's a good one. Skills will taunt. Uh. Yeah, taunt. Taunt this one. Vampire bite. Okay. Nice. Yeah, well, Holy Blast too, why not? Taunt him. Shadow Strike. Yeah, see, his blocking... What would that have done if he wasn't blocking? Probably 120, something like that. It would have been a lot, I think. There we go. Vampire dust. Awesome. Alright. I guess not all the guards were in on this after all. Yeah, it's sad. Right. Oh, you have to crawl under that. Uh, let's see. I mean, I don't expect any other secret passages, but... Whoa, what is this place? The elves who once inhabited Arafel built many such structures in places like this. Look up, you can see the sky from here. Well... So, what's with the shiny, shiny stuff? Okay. Interesting. At least we can open it back up. Oh yeah, more more dawn flowers. So right, I assume we have to do something with this tombstone to open the seal on that the doors. Lord Azariel the second, sixty-one RT to one of three RT. Rest in peace, Azariel. That name. Oh, it's the name of that song I learned. I wonder if that will work again. Hey guys, watch this. It does seem like it's having an effect. Or, well, maybe. But also Nash was Azariel, wasn't he? Ah, okay. That was very nice, Alita. We really do need to rescue Seri Kesu, though. The last time I did that, something happened. Is that Mr. Arger's flute? He has mouth on that, you know? It's magic! Come, we've no more time to waste here. I think this whole Chosen One has gone to your head, Lita. I'm sure something happened just now. We have to, we just have to find it. And besides, it doesn't matter. We can't go into... 
We can't get into that sealed door anyway. That is funny though. He had his mouth on that, you know? It's like, yep. <laughs> Was she not? No, he, he didn't see that the last time. Yep, yeah, and it's showing us again, just in case. Oh, it's just taking us there. Aha, this door was closed before. I bet my flute did that. I told you this thing was magic. Interesting, perhaps it did after all. You've used that flute before, you said? I played that song at some Azariel Shrine of Ere. It lifted the fog and opened the door to Nash's room. Elves once used songs that acted like keys to unlock objects. I wonder what else that song might do. I don't know. Let us save, though, just to... Uh, okay. She's doing this automatically. These are items in Seri Kesu's gear. Shh, I hear something. Wait. We have to get in there. I likely use her as a shield if we attack now. Wait for an opportunity to separate them. The second that freak steps away from her, I'm jumping him. Well, you gotta get the door open first. Just be patient. Find a place to hide. You mean like now? Siam's voice comes into focus. Not a threat to us. This all will end the second you tell me why you're taking the girl to Orlean. She's locked away with no hope of escaping. She will be killed. This is over. There's no need for your torment to continue. I have no desire to keep you here. We know all your plans. Barrymon has reported your every move. We know everything except why you're taking Lita to Temple Orlean. Now tell me and let this end. Wow. She's all messed up. I'm not telling you a damn thing, and you're a fool if you think I'll take you at your word. Yeah, exactly, right? The moment he tells you, or she tells you, you know, you're dead anyway, so you may as well... Well, right. The the word is that he'll give you a quick death, presumably. And yet my word is all that you have. It does not have to be this way, my lady. I will do all that I can to see this drag on for as long as possible if you continue to resist. I will keep you alive for months, years. Eventually you'll break. I don't suppose you'd indulge me in explaining what this plan of yours actually entails. Your people are briefly cursed with stone, but mine are cursed for the rest of time with this damned blight. Do you truly not understand? I'm a vampire sorceress, and I live in constant torment. I will see it end. What is in Temple Orlean? Freeze in the abyss, you monster. It's a shame you feel this way, sorceress. Many of my kind revel in violence, but we are not all so prone to succumb to our baser instincts. I have no desire to do this to you. You have a disease, a sickness, a curse. You survive by spreading it, by taking the lives of innocents. Do you think I enjoy it? That my only options are to kill or die? I only want to be human again. I don't care if you enjoy it or not. I will not help you. Our curse will be lifted, sorceress, and you will come to change your mind one way or another. I will give you some time to reconsider my proposal. It will go poorly for you when I return. I... I feel like if this dude truly wants to... The fact that he's alluding to breaking the vampiric curse. Um, you know, Barrymon probably wants to be... I don't know what Barrymon wants, but it seems like a lot of vampires do want to be, you know, violent. He... If it's true that he doesn't, this would have been an opportunity to explain himself to... You know... And it could have been her opportunity as well to, to get him to to talk or whatever. Um, but they don't want to... The, the, the writers don't want to do that yet. Anyway. Right. And then he gives her a final... Oh, come on. They would have seen us. Uh, yeah, and he gives her, he's like, I don't want, I don't like violence, I don't want to do this, I'll return, and then punches her a last time before he leaves, like, that's, I mean, maybe. 
Okay. Keep watch over her. Ensure she has enough water to survive no more. If she falls asleep, wake her. Otherwise, she is not to be touched. Yes, my lord. And come on, they... They totally would have seen us. Oh, crap. I... It said, oh, great, another shift standing around listening to Zyam's prisoners moan all night. You know, this one's not half bad looking, or she would be if her face wasn't all smashed up. I wonder what Zyam meant by don't touch. Adrian, I think that's our cue. Come on. These dudes are idiots. This is a dude that's like, don't touch her. You're watching him torture someone to death. And you're like, oh, I wonder if I could get away with touching her. I'm not touch. Oh, like you're nothing. If he does this to people, you know, like, come, come on. I know you're, I mean, they're trying to be like, it thing is, it probably would happen. Right, but yeah, I mean, it, it totally would happen. Idiots, though. People are people are freaking stupid. I was uh, when I was deployed, there was one of the dudes that I was with, and we were literally standing guard. And he's like, "I'm gonna take a nap. I'm gonna, you know, it's nighttime. I'm I'm tired. I'm gonna take a nap." I'm like. Are you, are you serious? Dude, get your ass up. He's like, no, no, I'm gonna sleep. And it was, it was a problem because uh, he was, he was in personnel. So it's like, if I, if I force it, like the fact that he thought that was okay. Like, oh, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm out in the middle of a combat zone. Uh, I'm just gonna take a nap. Like you're an idiot. But he was in personnel, and so if I pushed the issue, maybe my pay would get screwed up. Maybe other things would happen to me. You, you know what I mean? So it's like I have to basically choose between maybe getting killed and... Realistically, probably nothing was going to happen, but... Then he'd be pissed at me and do some underhanded stuff later, and it's like... So, yes, absolutely. You know, it's crap like this is, yeah. Anyway, I think that's our cue. Abyss, it's the prisoners, get them. All right, well, they're both enchanted. Uh, yeah, we'll just blast you. taunt this one because they do have the, the skewer thing. Mm. It still frustrates me. That stupid shit. The guy falling asleep or taking a nap, you know. Like that's that's the thing, right? Like you play all these you you play Metal Gear and the guards are sleeping and stuff, and you're like, what kind of idiot would do that? It's like, yes, I've been with these MFers that do that stuff. You know, don't feel, uh, don't feel bad about these dude killing these sleeping guards. They know they're in a combat zone and they deliberately, at least some of them, some of them are probably tired, but yeah, you know. I still can't believe that, and that still bothers me, but yeah. Especially when I walk, watch these, like, um... Uh, like these YouTube channels that are talking about how... A ship goes down and kills everyone on board because, you know, one guy... Like, he's watching TV when he's supposed to be on the watch, or... Or he, you know, turns on something that, like... Opens up hatches underneath the ship and then he forgets about it and goes and lays down and the ship floods and sinks. It's like people are people are dumb and they make dumb decisions all the time. Sari Kesu. 
We just leave the guards' mangled bodies on the floor. He managed to escape. It... it... By the goddess, Serikesu, save your strength. It took you long enough. I see even torture is unable to soften you. Can you walk? Not while chained to the wall. Thank you. There's an elven ruin near here that the vampires are using as a base to infiltrate the castle. Hmm. I believe we passed it while getting to you. The door was locked. It's guarded by a seal. I think a sufficient burst of magical energy will break it. You're the only one among us capable of delivering it. Do you have the strength? Do you have enough strength? We'll find out when we get there. Give me a life potion. Much better. Now let's go. So... Couldn't he just be like, heal me? Couldn't she just be heal me? You know what I mean? Well, we got items and crafting and stuff, so... Did it actually use a potion? I don't know. Still. Uh... Okay, knowledge 2, increase wisdom by 20. Yeah, enemies drop 50% more gold. It's like, that's good. Oh, immortality. Increases HP by 40. That's pretty good. That's pretty good, you know? Uh, right, and then skills. Yeah, I'm so... annoyed by Earth. All right, well, this increased the potency by five, which would, it would do more damage than fire, but, or increase potency by five. So all these just increase potency. Um, we'll do this, lightning is fine. I don't know, I mean, we're not gonna use it on anything else anyway. We have one more skill that she'd be able to upgrade, so. Okay. Jump. I like that they're still including that stuff. The jumping and, and all that. Alright. Let me handle this. Okay. Nice. That should do it. Let's move. Uh, let me save. Where... Uh, here. That's fine. Okay. By the goddess, would you look at this place? These are really elven ruins? They are. This temple was built eons ago, when human civilization had human civilization had barely begun. When the elves disappeared, many of the temples and strongholds were overrun with vampires and other creatures. This, if I recall, was used as a place to house the vampires' prophecy concerning the end of days. The vampires have a prophecy, huh? Do I even want to know what they predict? Whatever it is, I expect we are standing in their way. Keys zero. Well, let's go into the other door. Okay. Combat start. Green slime. All right, holy blast. Uh, let's try power attack. Uh, almost. Still lots of defense. Nice. Alright. What do we have here? Kobolds or something? Oh, okay. Kobold custodian, assassin, and fighter. I expect these guys are probably going to be a little tougher, but... Hmm, I wonder where this goes, because they're basically giving us two dungeons. 
Let's see if we can take out the assassin. Yes, we can. All right. Uh, probably doesn't. Let's taunt them. Or, uh, oh yeah, power attack. Yeah, fighter. Hmm. Nice. Very nice. Yeah, just regular attack. Alright, heavy hide. Lots more experience, though, for these guys. I hope there's something good in here. Uh, let's try the assassin. Maybe we can kill him. Ah, damn it. I was really hoping that would work. Oh, and, well, we could do 600 of these guys, right? Yeah. Probably should have gone for the fighter instead, but... Very nice. All right, you. Hmm. Yeah, more attack. Oh, yes. Come to Papa. All right, well, that, uh, Oh, what is this there? I know that's something we step on. It's like a switch. Kind of. Very nice. Magic dust. I'll take it. Oh, use teleport. Teleport to where? I don't know. We'll clear out all these guys. We'll open the chests. Bronze ingot. Yeah, we're still... At this point, you're basically... Still... Upgrading stuff. If you're not spending money. Okay... Vampire dust. Hmm. <sighs> it's kind of funny. It's like my, my brother flies in tomorrow and I'd like to... Oh, there is a... Right, there's a passageway in there. I'd like to... um finish the game before he arrives, but I don't think that's going to happen. It seems... It still seems pretty long. Nice. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, Mark? No, Whirlwind. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so all those dudes are gone. I don't know where the teleport goes to. Oh, is this something? No. Let's try going through the door then. Oh, you were still alive, eh? Two assassins. You know they're mean hombres because they have the, uh... Two small swords, two knives, daggers, whatever you want to call it. Getting closer. All right. What's in here? Good. I didn't want it to be like a whole big other area. And then I'll try using the teleport and see where it goes. Ah, 
almost passed this one by for a second. I was like, wait, what? Okay. Yeah, these ruins remind me a lot of Secret of Mana. The, um... Diamond, eh? Rainbows seem to dance inside of it. I wonder how much it's worth. Not that it, um... Alright. Oh, this. Yes. The Holy Retribution? Yeah, that seems like... Like it could be pretty awesome. I don't know if it stacks, but... If it does, that would be amazing. And then, um... This would potentially be the better one. Right? Because if, if you need to use it, if you need to revive everyone, you want them to be in fighting condition. Because they won't get to go until the next turn, so they might just get killed again, in which case this would help, but... Yeah, probably... Probably this, especially with the magic. Oh, um... Oh, no one can use... Everyone's skills requires two exotic stones. Uh, yeah, let's fight. Fight some of these guys. It's funny, you'd think the custodian would run away. Like, he's just there sweeping the floors, man. Or mopping, or whatever. I was just there mopping the floors, and then all of a sudden... Ooh, rare hides. But I think we have enough of those, right? Oh, yeah, I think we have plenty. Uh, oh, yes, absolutely. We only need... A few. All right. Take out the custodian. Wow. It's pretty impressive. Uh, so close. I guess I'll fight you. Holy blast away. All right. Now, for you... Yeah, I mean, yes. It's strange, right? Because it doubles his MP. Hmm. You'd think this would still... Well, I guess let's find out. Okay, so it's 192 now. Okay, it does. It still doubles it. That's fair. There's 202. Use teleport. Where are we, uh... Really? Aren't we... I guess... We're just at the bottom? That's fine.
so close, Adrian. You're so close to just straight up murdering. <laughs> murdering kobolds. All right, well, that was good. That was a good little... Good little thing. All right. Keep an eye out for shinies. It's very dramatic. Ah, what's up, Solani? Wow, what a strange place this is. I wonder what's inside. Lots, lots of stuff. She has another exotic stone. How? Does she have one every time I find her in a new place? Is that what happens? That's not crafting, no. Um, should I just finish her or oh, what about you? Power attack? Right. Life leech or mana leech? Um, he doesn't use a lot of mana. Probably go with life. I have to choose. What about you? Right. Remove the injury or can cast in advance. Oh, that's a hard one. Increase the speed, increase dodge rate. Um, hmm. Ah, crap. Potency or speed reduced. There we go. Alright, so she is... She's done. I mean, well, with the exotic stones. Saving. Nice. More kobolds. Oh, we got more stones. Man, they're starting to give us the stones now. Okay... see sparkly stuff over there. It looks like iron ore. Okay, well, there, there's a lock, right? Keys, zero. We probably should just go after these dudes and just kill everything, because we need money. Especially if she's going to continue selling orbs. Also, I won't, I won't turn away level ups and stuff, you know? Oh, maybe we should sell some of our, um, like the hides. Oh, I was like, I was like, wait, what? What's stopping me for a second there? All right, shop, sell. Uh, crafting materials. Yeah, see, look, we're already at... And rare hides. Should I sell some of those? Um... Yeah, okay. And I'll use this money. You know, we'll use it later when it comes time to purchase, like, magic dust or... Or more of those exotic stones. It's like, she's selling them, so it's like, okay, yeah, I mean, she could charge whatever she wants, because we need them.
two. Nice. Oh, interesting. What's going on down there? I just wonder what I should use the next. The next one on. Now I got two more stones, I can upgrade a skill again. there. Interesting. Well, we need, we probably need to like pick one then. It's a boss. Um, oh wait, it's before we save. Skills. Uh, so in this case... So basically, either gain magic or or uh, recoup my magic cost, or get it get it for free, or gain magic from using it, and then or get life. Um, in your case, injury status effects are removed from the ally when revived. This is a hard one, because I'd prefer this. Um, but... If, if he's like, oh, I'm not going to do anything, I could start by casting this on myself. So, ultimately, this is the better one. Especially if you think... If there's going to be, like, a party wipe spell, this would be the one to do it. I think we have to do this one. Um, and maybe I should have done that with, um, her as well. You know, her, uh, special ability. Uh. Whoa, it's another one of those awful white monsters, Adrian, I found in those ruins. I don't, I don't remember this, but okay. Vampirism causes the aging process to slow down, but can mutate the body. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Right, the first monster we found. This is the end result of that mutation. Oh god, they're horrible. Keep your guard up, they're also deadly. This place is full of them, then. That is pretty strong. Uh, well. Let's do some... Okay, we'll see how this goes. Right, skills, we'll taunt it. Um... Pretty strong. Hmm. Not bad. Let's try Mark. Okay, so she still has... Let's do lightning. Although this will probably kill it. Yeah. 
All right, charm dust. Oh, there you go. Not very much experience. Ah, oh, and we need a key. Normal key. Two iron ore. Fair enough. Well then, we have... Let's see, can we... Nope. No upgrading anything yet. Gold key. Where was the other... Back at the beginning here? No. Hmm. I could have sworn I remember seeing a, another key somewhere. Well, that's fine. Uh, yeah. It'll hopefully be okay. Another white? Yeah. Well, and this time we've seen it already, so we could do... Sure. Ah, okay. Damage is increased. Well, we'll see if it attacks. For now, let's do... Do regen on her. I am just gonna mark. I'm not gonna taunt. Because I want to see if it'll attack her again. Okay, so there she got the... Mmm, and it is based on those attacks. Nice. It does! That's awesome. That's pretty good. Well, I don't, I don't know if it will... I don't know if it stacks, but it's there. It's at least there longer. Another key. Another key. Normal key two. Iron ore two. Can we craft anything? Yes. The circlet. Wow, a lot of defense. Interesting, the block strength. Oh yeah, we don't have any. Well, that's fine, we could do the Mystic Circlet. I don't even know how I made this. Yeah, we'll do it, that's fine. Metal Helm. It took me so long to scrounge up enough metal for this. Indeed. Still, every little bit helps. Okay, I thought that was something. Oh. Weird. Okay. Oh man, this whole area is weird. I was gonna fight the dude, but I was like, oh, shiny. Shiny stuff. <laughs> Most importantly, get all the shiny things. Well, that was really neat. That worked out. The the divine retribution or whatnot. That I think is pretty neat. Man, this area is so. Oh, okay, there's one of the area. Uh... This area is so big. We've gotten two keys. Oh, interesting. More different slimes. Let's see. I'm gonna say they're all kind of the same, but let's get rid of the red slime first, because I don't know. Because it's different, and I don't know what it does. 
Uh, hmm. I don't think we can... Okay, he can kill one of them at least. That's good. Nice. Oh, oh, uh, well, yeah, that makes sense. One, some poison, some chill. Pretty good experience, too. Iron ore. I just don't know where all these doors go. I mean, look at it. Wait, did I just loop around? Well, so I wonder in this case what the difference between, I mean, what's the functional difference between poison and burning, you know, they both just do damage. Okay, yeah, I have I have been this way. I'm so confused. This is such a maze. Well, there's another This is where we were sort of were at the beginning cuz you choose like the left path or I don't I don't know. Man, I'm super tired all of a sudden. I don't know why. Could be the lack of sleep. I woke up at like midnight or 2 a.m. or something like that. I wasn't super paying attention, but uh, yeah, I couldn't really get back to sleep. So power up would be good. Yeah, let's just do power. I mean, wisdom is good, but... Yeah. All right. Right. Okay. Uh. These red stones. Okay. Got bookshelves. Oh! Vampire Prophecy. Hmm, I wonder if I should read it. If this is written in the vampiric language, I doubt you'll be able to. Nor will I, for that matter. There may be a way to translate it hidden away in this place, however. Vampires have been known to create magical interpreter devices for use in indoctrinating the familiars. Quest added prophecy. Um, okay. Man, what's up with all these... rooms? I found strange parchment with vampire, vampire texts written on them. I should find a way to translate them. Maybe we can figure out a way to escape. Ah. I see. So this is required. This is a vampire's work, I believe, or at least painted in a similar style. This kind of art is often significant to vampires for reasons more than just aesthetics. I wonder if these paintings are used for something. Painting godlike. Huh. Okay. Another vampire prophecy. A bolt of energy streaks across the sky, called down by some angry goddess. Words etched into stone. I feel a little sick when I touch it. Okay. Well... All right, um... All oh, right, we've been... Hmm. Let's try to go to the non-lock areas first. So we did go down here. 
There's the gold key. Presumably that's the way out, right? Let's go in here. More paintings that we could probably take. Painting for lights. Painting candles. I assume we're gonna need them, but I don't know what for yet. I guess let's read the descriptions. Four colored lights collide into an explosion of color in this painting. Oh, we never figured out what to use the ancient elven bow with. But we probably will need it. It's for fighting vampires, after all. An array of spooky candles. I bet it's the final upgrade or something. What is the deal with this? You jump down? Ah, it's a one way. Painting night. Oh, there's a dude over there. There's several people. Lots of people. You think they're all vampires? Or, well, vampire familiars at least. A dark night with vivid stars that somehow seem to twinkle even on the canvas. Neat. Maybe they're radioactive. Vampire prophecy. Okay, where the heck am I now? Is this just above? Yes, okay. Um, hmm. Oh, here's a room. I guess we went in there and got the ore. Aha. Uh -huh. I was trying to figure out where you know, I saw the door and I'm like, "Oh, I don't want to I don't want to fight all those dudes." Okay, another vampire prophecy and yet another one. And a normal key. So now we have three keys. All right, well, there's a couple. Oh. Okay. It must have been moving down or something. I didn't quite understand how that works, but, uh, you know. Fire! Oh, good. I was really hoping for that. Okay. Oh, very close. Well, I assume we need to get into those rooms. I just didn't know if I specifically wanted to do it yet. Oh, and there's another. And that goes down. Um, hmm. And this just goes back where we came from, right? Yeah. Alright, well, I think that's most of the doors. Yep. Alright, well, let's, um... We'll go in through this door real fast. And see if we can, uh, because we still have a couple minutes. If possible, I'd like to get more vampire prophecies. She gets a level up, which is nice. Then, more power. It's just the best, the best thing to do. All right, keys are now two. All right, what is this? I bet that's the translator. But maybe not, who knows? Because it looks like a gem or something. Or maybe it's a piece of it, I don't know. Oh, 
All right, magic dust. Oh, never mind, warrior stone. It's good, man. Warrior stones are good. Okay. How many more of those do we have to push? Uh, skills. Okay, you. Let's see. Increased duration by one turn. That's probably good. Or whirlwind. Oh, yeah. Extra potency. Yes, absolutely. Okay, I guess I'll just walk by you two. I saw some more sparkly. There we go. Iron ore. The columns are going. Oh, they just straight up explode. It's very dramatic. A little bit more dramatic than I expected if... Oh, I didn't even... Yeah. If I'm being honest. Nice. As much as I like Whirlwind, just killing an enemy is better, if there's only two left. Alright. Alright, what's up here? Fire Essence, excellent. Ah, oh, but we can't go through this door yet. This barrier is different than the previous one. My magic won't work on it. We'll have to find another way. Alright, well let me... I guess we'll... So we have to come here later. Let's fight these guys. And then I'll stop. Man, I love that. Alright, and then I'll get some food. Alright, almost. One more. And the fire essence, that's not enough to... I don't think that's going to be enough to upgrade. I know we need it, but I don't know... I need it for my weapons, but I don't know what else we need. But I'm pretty sure I don't have whatever the ingredients are. Excellent. Level up. Yeah, unfortunately for you, though, I'm going to give you pretty much all power. You know, there's not a lot else for you to do at this point. You're pretty much a standard damage dealer. A little boring, but... Oh, we can craft some stuff. Ooh, can we do the Mystic Staff? What do you need? Silk. Okay. Well, I'd rather probably do this. Because extra damage. Metal conducts many things. Heat, electricity, and also magic. Oh, but it's physical damage. Crap. Oh, but she gets a block rate. Interesting. Well, we could try fighting something real fast, see if she does more damage. I don't think... I don't remember what she's doing for damage. And it's entirely possible we'll, we'll kill these guys. Wait, and then... I don't remember... Okay, well that was definitely a critical hit, so I don't... I couldn't tell. Uh, let's move over to where the, uh, yeah, we'll save right here. Because we have two keys left, and there's something else. All right, guys, that is it for today. Thank you guys so much for your time and attention. Really do appreciate it. Really hope you guys are enjoying these episodes. 
As always, guys, questions, comments, concerns, good, bad, or indifferent, let me hear them. I do read all of them, assuming they're not memory hold. I do try and respond to all of them. It usually takes me a few days, though, so just be patient, I suppose. Um, what's your guys' unique positive moment for today? For me, I'm going to go with this coffee. Ever since I figured out, I know it sounds stupid, I figured out to add more. Uh, yeah, it's been a lot better. It's just tasted better, so... It's very strange, though. I didn't expect it, because every other coffee I use, I use the same amount. It tastes fine, but these, just less. It didn't taste as good. It's very, very odd. It's the first time that's happened, so... Uh, but still, it's good coffee. That's my unique positive moment. Hopefully your guys are just as good, if not better. Hopefully better, of course. And I hope to see you guys next time. Till then, guys, take care.